Okay, we're gonna shoot these bottles with the uh, soft point. I hope the point of aim is not off too much from the the other ones, but uh, we're gonna we got I think five or six bottles set up down there, and we're gonna go ahead and shoot those with the soft point. Six bottles back to back. So here we go. Here we go. We gonna make some noise, boys. Uh -huh. We're gonna shoot them six bottles back to back. What's that? Uh, Dave's about to do the old soft point test. Okay. I just died shot. Shoot them back. Five dollars around. Two-legged varmints, too. Well, that better leave before we get the show that. I hope my camera's still running. Six hundred fifty grain soft point. At what? What are you shooting at? Six bottles back to back. Okay, on the ground. Yeah. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think I was right. I oh. told Adam all of them oh. be gone. <laughs> I don't know where you guys got the idea. Oh, here's a five dollar bill now. <laughs> it went flying. So, you know, we don't know if it's a bullet or it could have been frag, you know. Time to go and check it out. I got to see if my camera's still running too down there. <laughs> you didn't see if that one smacked up. It's really that thick. It went through four bottles. And uh, fragged that one. Fragged one a little bit. Is it all the way through, or? No, it's just one side. Cracked it. Yeah, huh. Well, you said that's okay. kind of weird. So everybody that thinks that 50 cal is just ballistically uh, go through, you know, a ton of armor. This is the number five water jug and as you can see the 650 grain bullet is actually captured in this fifth bottle it penetrated pull it out of there penetrated the front did not come out the back and there it is laying in the bottom of the bottle we're going to take it out and let you take a look at it bullet there it is and it did separate Poor separation. Poor separated a little bit there, but there it is, completely mushroomed. Yep. And uh, these are these bullets are made by Copperhead Swaging in, in Arizona, yeah. and I had him sent me a couple to test. And there's your test. Uh, that Not would much lead left. Definitely do some damage to uh, to uh, large size game, and as you can see. It mushroomed really nicely and uh, would definitely do the trick and not have a runaway animal. So and that core pieces. We've got little pieces. What kind of animal split. would you be hunting with that? Well, elk at about <laughs> 1,800 yards, but 
But this was at this shot was taken at 50 yards, so uh, it was still going pretty fast when it hit them bottles, and it stopped in the fifth bottle. It was actually captured within the fifth bottle of water, and these bottles are not, you know, they're not gallon jugs. These are these were like uh, half gallon juice bottles or something. So uh, pretty impressive.